Spiritual sickness bears a death. The act of sinning, slowly by slowly, it brings a death. This is why you hear the word of God says that the wages of sin is death. And you as a child of Christ, if you continue working on sin and the protecting sin, you know that you know something is sin, then you continue in sinning on it. That is what is called spiritual sickness. It grows to bear death. The wages of sin, if you continue to, to, to sin, you continue to work in sin, doing transgressions, committing abominations, doing evil. I tell you, the end of you is just to commit uh, that. Uh, at the end of you is just to, 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 to die. Sin brings death. There is no shortcut for sin. Sin bears death. Yes, you may laugh uh, uh, when in sin. You may enjoy sin uh, most in the, in the pressures of sin. But I tell you, what you will follow is just death. Prematurely. Prematurely death. This is why Moses said that he will not sit down and enjoy the pleasures of the world. And he chose rather to go and, and be afflicted or go and receive uh, torments with the children of Israel, the children of God, rather than enjoying the pleasures in the kingly house. The pleasures of this world is just for a, for a short period of time. And there is a time that is coming that you will not enjoy being on those pressures of the world. So it is better that you repent now and you wake up from your slumber. Jesus Christ is coming. Take away those filthiness from your life. Be healed from your spiritual sickness and be in good health. And the Lord will bless you and remember you in Jesus' name.